and welcome to 8 out of 10 Cats Uncut, a show all about opinion polls, surveys and statistics. Did you know, for example, students have to apply for an average of 24 jobs before they find a position? Things are tough out there. I met a guy recently who told me he had a first with honours, an MA and a PhD. I said, that's great, but I asked you for a burger without pickle. <laughs> 72% of people find spending time with animals relaxing. I like having dogs around, but my girlfriend objects to all the licking of balls and sniffing of bums. She says it upsets the dogs. <laughs> and 40% of men worry about getting fat. There's a simple test for men. Look down at your stomach. If it's flat, you've got nothing to worry about. If it's sticking out a bit, you might need to go on a diet. And if you can't see your stomach because your boobs are getting in the way, you've got a problem. <laughs> What yes. has the nation been talking about this oh, week? Right. What do you think, Joe? Oh, possibly Miley Cyrus smoking a joint somewhere. Mm. Yes, Miley Cyrus allegedly smoked a joint at the MTV Music Awards. There she yeah. is with the herbal cigarette. <laughs> is she going swimming straight after that? <laughs> Jordan, what did you think of it? You're, you're a pop star. Well, she came out in the news recently and said um, she's not being um, exploited. She's actually in complete control of what she's doing and she's the world's biggest feminist. <laughs> can, I just, can I just say, I literally am the biggest feminist. <laughs> <laughs> so if Miley wants to come and see me, she can. Would you put a flea in her ear? I bloody well would. <laughs> put a fucking fist in her ear. <laughs> like about her, slightly like about her, is she's kind of getting it slightly wrong. You know, because normally people are they, they, they're overtly sexual, they try and be really cool. Yeah, that's what... Was... And she sort of does it slightly... I think she sort of is making these decisions, because I'm sure the, the record executives wouldn't be keen on the whole dwarf thing. Like, she goes, <laughs> she goes on stage with loads of dwarves, and they probably think, that's not actually... It's a bit just weird, and it's a bit it's uncool. I mean, she's, about, she's literally a whisker away from lighting her own farts. <laughs> 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 Like snot balloons next, and they're going uh, like that. She's just, she's trying. I think she's sort of is in charge of what she's doing, and she hasn't she's got quite a bit nailed mad. what sexy is. I think the problem with Miley Cyrus is that, uh, that because she was a Disney child, yeah. uh, it's so much more tragic. Everyone thinks that Disney gone bad, you know, like Definitely. Britney Spears, and it, it's sort of <laughs> like Dumbo shagging Bambi or something. You know? <laughs> <laughs> it's like Disney gone nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> you just ruined my childhood. <laughs> I watched the footage of her at the EMAs and I was shocked because how in the name of sweet bell peppers she's won an award for music. Yes. Why is no one talking about that? The award winners at that thing were Justin Bieber, her and One Direction. Why is nobody reporting the fact that music is dead? <laughs> Let's have a look and see if Miley is up there. <laughs> yes, Miley Cyrus caused controversy, allegedly smoking marijuana on stage at the MTV Music Awards, although I saw the footage of Miley and I think I could see a better crack. <laughs>